Hey guys, I mean Nizzle here, and I want to show you guys how to make double beds. Now what you, I've, what I've done is uh, I've put some double beds over here as an example. These are using the stairs. Uh, over here, this is the most standard one. Uh, it uses wooden doors, iron doors. The benefit of the iron doors one is you can't open them without having a lever or some uh, pressure plate. And here's the basic one with uh, just wooden planks and a stair. Now what I've done is of course I made a canopy on top of it uh, and the vines should grow down all the way and you should be able to walk in and out. So it should look pretty nice and of course you can put some glowstone in there or torches or anything and it will look nice. right? So that's that. Um, I am going to show you guys how to build one of these because they're not 100% straightforward. Uh, I'm going to make one using bookshelves. So what you do is you put down bookshelves, put down some more bookshelves, make sure there's enough room here for the beds, and then you take some, some crappy material that you just have lying around anyways, and take some more bookshelves, and some more bookshelves, here we go. Then you take your beds, place them like this, you knock out the one in the bottom, place another bed, Place another bed, lock the ones out in the bottom, and there you have it. Now you have your bookshelves double bed. And like I said, you can of course make a canopy, and on the canopy you just put your vines, and then you can put lightstone, uh, what's it called, yes, uh, lightstone, or you can put these torches. And on some of the things you can put your ladders, so, you, so it's easy to get up to. Now, it does each and every, every one of these beds can be slept in. It's not like they're blocking each other. There is like a slight little angle that you have to go through. Like if you want to sleep in the furthest one bed, like if I try to click like this, I won't be able to reach it. But if I am a bit further away, like this up, I should be able to sleep in it. You can only sleep at night. See that? That's one thing. Now, I did make some uh, extra little things. A lot of people, they don't really know how to use the nightstands because there are no nightstands. So here's just some examples. This is the, the end sandstone. It's only in the patch 1.5, uh, 1.9 pre-release 5. It's right here, end stone. This is uh, mycelium, if I'm pronouncing it correctly. Mycelium, sorry, my bad. Um, you can use chests. You can use just wooden planks. You can use bookshelves. You can use note blocks, and you can use these um, uh, tree trunks and uh, obsidian. Now, another thing about beds that I quickly wanted to show before I end this video is in the end and in the nether. If you place your bed and you try to sleep in it, something interesting happens. I'll link uh, something in the description on how I discovered this. Because I didn't discover this in the nether, I discovered this in the end. When you try to sleep in the in the nether, or in the end for that matter, this happens. <laughs> so yeah, have fun trying uh, trying out some double beds and trying to blow up the whole freaking world with your beds. Thanks for watching. Do subscribe. Bye bye.